Greetings everyone, before we dive into today's topic, we'd like to extend a warm welcome to our newest member, Suriking1350. Thank you for your support. Today we're delving into a significant development in naval technology as the U.S. Navy postpones its next-generation submarine program, the SSNX. Your membership helps us bring you these up-to-the-minute insights, so we truly appreciate your support. Without further ado, let's delve into why the U.S. Navy has postponed its next-generation submarine program. The U.S. Navy is pushing back the start of the SSNX program, its next-generation attack submarine, to the early 2040 This decision, while surprising to some, is grounded in a blend of fiscal realities and operational priorities. The Navy, like any massive organization, must balance its budget and allocate its resources wisely. In this case, the need to prioritize current operations has taken center stage. As we know, the present demands of naval operations are vast and varied, spanning the globe and requiring a significant portion of the Navy's budget and attention. From maintaining existing fleets and infrastructure to ensuring the readiness of personnel, these ongoing operations are crucial to the Navy's ability to fulfill its mission today. However, the delay of the SSNX program isn't just about diverting funds to meet present needs, it's also about the Navy's commitment to responsible acquisition practices. It's no secret that military projects, especially those of this scale, can be complex and prone to cost overruns or technological hiccups. By pushing the start date of the SSNX program to the early 2000s, the Navy is allowing itself more time to plan, test, and ensure that every aspect of this next-generation submarine is ready before construction begins. This approach underscores the Navy's emphasis on technology readiness. The SSNX isn't just another submarine, it's set to be a technological marvel, integrating new advancements in stealth, propulsion, weaponry, and more. It's a testament to the Navy's recognition that rushing into production without ensuring the readiness and reliability of these technologies could lead to costly mistakes down the line. So, the Navy's delay in launching the SSNX isn't just about money. It's also about ensuring that the technology and operations are ready and up to the task. It's a strategic move that reflects the Navy's commitment to preparedness, fiscal responsibility, and technological innovation. It's a delay, yes, but one that could lead to a more efficient, effective, and advanced submarine when the time comes. The SSNX program isn't the only one feeling the pinch. Other modernization programs are also being pushed back. The DDGX Next Generation Destroyer and the F-AXX Next Generation Fighter programs are prime examples of this. These programs, initially slated for a timely rollout, are now being delayed due to similar reasons as the SSNX program. This wave of delays is not just a simple pushback of schedules, it's a reshuffling of priorities based on operational needs and budgetary constraints. With resources being finite, the Navy has to make tough calls on where to allocate its funds. For the fiscal year 2025, the budget requests for these programs reflect a shift in funding levels. This isn't a cutback in the traditional sense, rather it's an adjustment that takes into account the current situation. The Navy is emphasizing responsible acquisition practices, ensuring that technology readiness is achieved before moving forward. The impact of these delays is far-reaching. It's not just about pushing back the introduction of new technology. It's about managing the life cycle of current systems, maintaining operational readiness, and balancing the need for modernization with the realities of budget and time constraints. It's a delicate and complex balancing act, but it's a necessary one, because at the end of the day, the Navy's mission is to ensure the security of our seas and the safety of our sailors. And that mission must always come first. These delays, while necessary, will have a significant impact on the Navy's modernization efforts. To sum it up, budget constraints and operational priorities have forced the U.S. Navy to delay its SSNX program and other modernization programs. These include the DDGX Next Generation Destroyer and the F-AXX Next Generation Fighter. The decision to postpone these projects was not taken lightly. It was a strategic move to ensure that current operations are properly funded. Despite these delays, the Navy has expressed its commitment to responsible acquisition practices. It is clear that they are prioritizing technology readiness before moving forward with these ambitious programs. 
The adjustments in funding levels for the SSNX, DDGX, and F-AXX in the fiscal year 2025 budget requests reflect this shift in priorities. In conclusion, the Navy's decision to delay is a strategic move, one that underscores the importance of responsible spending and readiness in the face of technological advancement and modern warfare. Such decisions, while they may seem disappointing in the short term, are crucial to ensure long-term operational efficiency and success. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up, leave a comment, and don't forget to subscribe. Your support helps us keep delivering quality content like this. Until next time.